Welcome. In front of me is a Samsung Galaxy S23 Plus and today I'll show you how you can enable and also set up your portable hotspot. So to get started let's pull down our notifications, extend the list and somewhere between the toggles here you should see a hotspot toggle. For me it's right over here, the exact name is mobile hotspot. Now this is the default location of the toggles, so hopefully you can find yours in the same exact place. Now once you see this toggle, first time around you want to hold it, this will quickly take you to the settings where you can select configure and start off by changing the garbage password that is randomly generated. Now the password that you will choose needs to have at least 8 characters in length, that can be letters, numbers, it doesn't really matter, and from there you can save it. So there we go. Uh, now obviously you can change other settings right here, for instance like the AP band if you want to. Uh, but if you are not exactly sure what this is, I recommend keeping it at 2.4. This will ensure uh, that your hotspot works every time you need it and whenever you connect to, well, to this hotspot with any kind of device. So from there we can close this and whenever you want to use your hotspot, simply find the toggle once more, tap on it. Now it does apparently also share our Wi-Fi. So Mobile Hotspot shares your Wi-Fi network. Uh, your phone's Wi-Fi network will be shared if you turn on Mobile Hotspot while connected to Wi-Fi network. Make sure you have permission from the network owner before sharing. So it allows you to actually utilize Wi-Fi instead of mobile data uh, for, for just a hotspot, which is pretty nice. So you won't be just completely wasting your mobile data on this. But obviously, um, this is primarily used when you're outside of your house and usually you will be using your mobile hotspot for this anyway. Uh, so it's nice inclusion that you can actually utilize Wi-Fi instead. Uh, just a gimmick here. Uh, it just gives you also a notification to have a permission. Uh, other than that, it's just a courtesy. It's not really like it's required. It will run from uh, Wi-Fi no matter if you have the permission or not. So yeah. Uh, anyway, once you're done with the hotspot, you can quickly turn it off by finding the toggle once more, tapping on it, and there we go, it's now off. Now I do recommend trying to remember about turning it off because hotspot will consume more of your battery, and if you're not using it, there is no reason for it to be running in the background. Now with this being said, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.